Hello everyone, welcome back to story time. I hope you all are doing good and today I'm going to read Mad About Dinosaurs by Gillis Andrea and David Washtovich. As the sun lies, the horizon and the mist begins to clear. What shapes can you begin to say? What noises can you hear? Perhaps you'll see a swishing tail, huge claw prints or a beak. I think I heard a distant roar and can you hear that shriek? Some of them have huge long necks and some have giant jaws. So come into the swampland and let's meet the dinosaurs. Tyrannosaurus Rex I'm big and strong and scary, but I'm very pleased to meet you because my giant gapping jaws are very keen to eat you. Ankylosaurus I've got armor on the top of me and armor underneath, so if you try to eat me up, you probably break your teeth. Velociraptor When I see a tasty herd of little dinosaurs, I catch a few for supper with my giant pointy claws. Microraptor I'm as little as a chicken, but please don't be too hasty. Although I may be chicken sized, I'm nothing like as tasty. Diplodocus I'm not the quickest thinker because my brain is very small. But who needs to be clever when you are 25 feet tall? Spinosaurus I'm sure you can see the big sail on my back. I use it for storing up heat. I also quite handy for making new friends because everyone says it looks neat. Triceratops I'm the Triceratops. How do you do? I've got these three horns on my head. They are useful for keeping my enemies back, but they are not very comfy in bed. Brontosaurus I'm the huge Brontosaurus. I nibble the tops of tall trees. I like to look down at my friends on the ground who barely reach up to my knees. Tyrannodon See the crest upon my head. It helps me when I glide. And the girl says it looks groovy as I swoop from side to side. Ichthyosaurus I'm the dolphin dinosaur. I live down in the sea and when I spot some scrumptious squid, I eat them up for tea. Stegosaurus Hello, I'm the stout Stegosaurus with two rows of plates down my back. I also got spikes on the end of my tail, which I use when I'm under attack. Giganotosaurus I'm enormous and fierce and strong. I live by the shores of the lake. There's a rumbling sound when I stomp on the ground and the earth starts to shudder and shake. So now you have met the dinosaurs. What a fierce bunch. Some of them would really like to eat you for their lunch. But some are not so scary. Some are gentle. Some are kind. If you tried to cuddle them, they probably wouldn't mind. But it's time to say goodbye now. So away will softly creep. Cause even great big dinosaurs have got to go to sleep.
I hope you all like today's story. If you like, could you please click on the bell icon given below to subscribe my channel. See you next week. Till then, be happy and healthy. Thank you.